Hello and welcome to Ukraine Today. My name is Peter Byrne and this is the Press Review. Republican Senator and U.S. Presidential hopeful Marco Rubio takes aim at Obama's misguided policies on September 21st in a 900-word op-ed appearing in the influential conservative National Interest Design. The consequences of six years of failed U.S. policy toward Russia have played out in the annexation of Crimea and the battlefield of eastern Ukraine. This policy has also helped prolong the humanitarian and strategic nightmare that Syria has become. According to Rubio, Obama still does not understand Putin's goals. They include the recognition of Russia as a geopolitical force, an achievement he has already achieved in Europe, at least according to Rubio. As for Syria, Obama worked with Putin to negotiate a deal whereby Assad agreed to give up his chemical weapons in return for an American commitment not to bomb him. The result was a bad deal that Assad did not fully honor. Like many conservative Republicans, would-be U.S. President Rubio believes Obama and his administration remain naively optimistic that Russia can be part of the solution in Syria. The U.S. also needs to help the victims of Russian aggression by providing them with arms, not just non-lethal supplies. The op-ed ends with Rubio calling on Obama to make it clear to Putin that Russia will not be allowed to create the same kind of havoc in the Middle East that he has in Ukraine for the past 17 months. This has been Peter Byrne with the Press Review. Join us again tomorrow for another edition.